Okay, what's up guys? We, uh, we're filming with the microphone now and without the fisheye to uh, kind of test both, both styles out. We got a couple things to do indeed. Uh, number one, the long awaited brakes on my car. Um, however, we're only doing half of them because last weekend I went and got my diff welded and in the process we replaced my rear pads. So it rides awful. It, yeah. The whole ass end just tries to tear itself apart every move you make whatever the real mission was to pull out my axles and find out if i had zenki or koki uh rear end so i could buy an lsd but in the meantime why not weld the diff so what was the verdict on that oh zenki so i got a zenki rear end definitely welded we need to also do this today. Oh, I'm getting nothing out of this. Yeah. We are also gonna go get rich at the coin star, so we're grabbing all of our change. DJ has like a shit ton. Oh yeah. Seven dollars and fourteen cents. I like the Walmart thing. Twenty seven eighty three. <laughs> Damn, I'm so close. Close, dude. Twenty eight twenty. Not bad. What's up guys? Oh shit, that would have been a sick ass place to park. Quentin had diarrhea, now that guy has to sweep it up. I feel bad, but it felt pretty good. <laughs> We are going down to AutoZone town. We're gonna get one of those little breaky, pushy inners. So on the way into uh, the Safeway parking lot, I had to take a right turn and I thought I, that I just like, was getting like weird mad understeer. We just pulled out of the parking lot again. And I almost ran into a fucking curb because I like was cranking to the right and I'm pretty sure only one of my wheels is turning. Huh. So yeah, it's really sick. So we'll find out on that turn over there. But uh, yeah, on the way up here, I was going about like 45, 50, and on right hand turns, it's just like, go, 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 go. So, like, I'm pretty sure my uh, side rods are just trying to escape from my car. All right, so <laughs> DJ tried to go into auto zone and get a uh, piston press to push the brake piston back in. But they wouldn't let me in. They, they didn't have it. They're like, nah. And then uh, they're like, we got it on shelf. Uh, so you could buy it if you want, but we don't have one to rent. And then... Uh, Turns out they didn't even have one on shelf. They didn't. <laughs> like, fuck off. All right, so hopefully we can get home with DJ's sick whip. Yeah. We're fucked. <laughs> Um, I got like one song I gotta record, another song I gotta re-record, and then another song that I haven't even learned how to play yet that I'm gonna cover. <laughs> so, you know. Fuck! Forgot to break the lugs. <laughs> Nothing's going right today. Alright, before we uh, jack up DJ's car and figure out what's wrong with it, we're gonna swap out the front and rear wheels on this car because they are facing the wrong direction as a lot of people have noticed and noted we're gonna jack it up with the bash bar because we haven't done that yet hopefully it goes well Let's speak. also we need to loosen this bearing because also another thing that a lot of people noted was that we tightened the bearing all the way down and we're not supposed to do that that happened that's a good noise <laughs> oh my god stop it this is the box where we put everything that we needed last time in case the next time we do something we need it again so like, 
came here looking for these and that's exactly what I found. Back that nut off a little bit. Rotor's a bit warped. Torque that baby to spec. <laughs> Put in our brand new cotter pin. And that's a job well done, Zell. Mommy and truth, yeah. Put in there, how's it make you feel the YouTube? The wheels are on the right way now. Yep, now I can't skid as mad as I used to because directional tires backwards on the rear. Yeah. More skids. Now they're just erectional tires. They've always been erectional. That's true, just like getting bitches. You can smell the grip, dude. Boom. All right, now we can take the car off the jack stains. Jack, jack. That's it guys, project's finished. Nobody knew about this because we, well we've had it for a while but we filmed it and it's in a more male video that we haven't uploaded yet. Someone sent DJ this. We paid for the shipping but he just sent it for free. Oh shit, oh, dude. Dude, it looks good. Yeah, it I didn't does. expect it to. I thought it was gonna look wonky and chunkly. Hold it. <laughs> dude, I wanna look at it. Yeah. Yo. You think this is gonna make me faster? I think so. I do wanna chunk out the cunt out. Or the <laughs> <laughs> I do want to cut a chunk out of uh, <laughs> gonna have to fucking gut this bitch. Dude, you're just gonna have to gut this bitch? Deal with it. Dude, function over form. I mean, form over function. <laughs> so the problem is that DJ's uh, car won't open from the inside like they should. The hatch. Yeah. Uh, when I pull the little like it loosens it, but I can't open it. It's still at. So I have to put the key in and pull up while I twist the key and if I can't reach the key then I have no way to open my hatch so this this wing covers the keyhole but it looks so sick That's dude cool. we could eat dinner on that and it's already black it's already shit terrible black. yeah it looks just like your front quarter yeah hey if you guys were looking to buy some uh, more skid stickers but they sold out super fast because we we're super sick then go to the fellas network and buy one of their more skids fellas network collab stickers yeah because they just put those up on their store and we'll have a link to it in our description if you want to check it out. And we will also have stickers, more stickers coming soon of ours. Because a lot of people were bummed that they sold out so fast because we only had like 25 a piece. Yeah, expect that soon. Hmm. Quinn, go give me a tug. A what? A uh, quick tug. Alright, we're going to attempt to figure out what that problem was that we experienced. Okay, so uh, DJ was about to go under his car, but it's super wet. And uh, we just remembered that Sam gave us that sick creeper creepster. And then we bought these new caster wheels for it. And we just never got around to doing it. Like this. Got it. Good eat. Cast her up, cast her out, rub her down. Thanks, Dad, for raising me right. Look at us all fancy for the White House. I ain't even wearing a hat tonight. Hey, look what I found. Nice. All right, all right we got the creeper all creeped out. Creep! Uh. <laughs> yep, worth it. All right, we're done here. <laughs> okay, so basically, we just got under the car and didn't do anything because we couldn't figure out what was wrong. On the bright side, I replaced the fuse, and now my clock works. It's like clockwork, dude. My headlights don't turn off when you open the door anymore. Oh. Did they turn off? Fuck you, you just... Uh, they didn't. You bad. No, they did! <laughs> they did. For real? Yeah. <laughs> For real? <laughs> that... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Like, oh, dude, what? This guy didn't even bolt down his wing. What? Oh, whoa. 
So we're just gonna go grab some self-tapping screws for DJ. Good. It's a semen doji bomb. Shit. Dude, he heard us talking shit about his van and he booked out of here. Because <laughs> he knows I can beat him. On the downhill. Tommy Takumi, don't fucking come to me. You rum from me. Your girl sucking cum from me. <laughs> Miners buying rum from me. Fishers buying chum from me. You scum compared to me. Mm. He couldn't handle the sick fucking rhymes, dude. That's the first time they failed us. We're gonna have to head to Johnson's to get some self-tappers. Dude, shout out to my grandma because <laughs> The funny story, um, my grandma's cousin or something actually owns this whole entire franchise. <laughs> so, How come we're not rich? Uh, I don't know. Um, so my parents told my grandma that we make videos and my grandma watched the video and she oh. emailed me yesterday, which tells <laughs> you a, a lot. Grandma like, it's a grandma do. thing. And uh, she emailed me and said, uh, I enjoyed watching one of your videos. They're not very geared towards old ladies like me, but I'm glad you put in the plug for Johnson's hardware. <laughs> we always come to Johnson's and we always pick out one of these like weird ass soda flavors, but they're never ever good. DJ, recap everything we just talked about. Basically, after the first world war, there was like just a huge influx of displaced people and they're like, well, where do we put them? And they're like, well, we got all this space over here in the Middle East, so we'll start a new nation. We'll call it mm, Palestine or something. Massive, massive influx of people. And Israel's like, hey, that was our land. That was the Holy Land. And they're like, no, this is, we need this now. No, okay. Well, yeah, it sucked. We actually only left the mic off and we talked about a we? whole like influx of people. I left the mic off and we just got back from Johnson's and we are going to put DJ's wing on his 8.6 now because we got the self-tapping screws. Oh, and what what's the what's the point of this? It's not for more skids, it's for... I'm not in on this joke. You know the punchline here and I don't. We already made the joke, but the camera was off. More downforce? What? Let's move all this stuff onto the wing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We don't have a place to put all this stuff, so we need to make one. So yeah, we're gonna make a little table here. Dude, I'm zooming so slow in on you. <laughs> hey, what up? <laughs> Dude, it looks sick. Kinda. Yeah, it does. It looks so sick. Yeah, I wonder what it looks like with stuff actually where it's supposed to be on the... There, that's better. Dude, look at all of our wingos. <laughs> Every wing. So we know that you're not really supposed to use... Uh, Scrump thumpers. Yeah, self-tapping screws for this job. But we're doing it anyways because it's a lot easier and we don't have a... Well, we do have a rivet, rivet, rivet gun, Rosie rivet. But yeah, we're just doing this because... <laughs> it's tradition at this point. <laughs> but yeah, uh, like we did on my car over here. <clears throat> At some point, I'm going to change those back to, or not back to, but to rivets. But yeah, like I said, today is not that day. This is really nice because it already had holes in it and it lines up perfectly. Oh. Hello. Hi. Just don't say anything, DJ. Wildest Wait. fantasy coming in. What? You're really, your service is really bad. Like it's like. How's this? College is hard and life is hard and. Hey, will you sing a song? Tell me why it ain't nothing but My roommates aren't here, so I can dance around. Okay, so say goodbye to the peoples. Aw, uh, bye peoples. That guy knows what's up. So DJ's wing is all done and it's being put to very good use. Beautiful. We should call up like uh, Adam Savage and Jamie Heineman and like Get this myth busted that wings are pointless. They have them like, like, have like measure it. like the downforce and like the speeds that the average like street car goes and all this shit. And then at the end they're like myth busted and they're all just like eating dinner <laughs> off of it. Alright, we got everything moved off of DJ's wing. Are you gonna do like actual skid or a uh... brake stand or what?
What happened? It finally happened. What just happened? My tie rod just came out. Oh shit. Oh no. At least it didn't happen while we were driving. <laughs> that's what that's the problem that me and DJ were trying to figure out. Yep. There it is. So there's that wheel. <laughs> there's that wheel. DJ was about to lay down the sickest skid too, which is a bummer. Okay, well, that's where DJ's car is going to sit for some amount of time because his tie rod is fucked. Or my steering rack, we don't know yet. Yeah, something's fucked. Something his brother's on his way over fair. to uh, pick DJ up and check out the car because yeah. I got to go to work in like 15 minutes. So hopefully uh, by the next video you see, we will have figured out what's wrong with my car and maybe even fix it. Yeah. But that's not how wheels work. No. Hey, let us know if you like this or the fisheye better. We also wanted to say sorry again for not having like an official 50k video because our plans got rained out, literally. And on the 29th, we are going to bring both of our cars to the racetrack and try to make up for it. We were going to make like a sick video for 50k, but it just didn't work out. So yeah, uh, that's it. We'll see you guys in the next video and thank you for watching.